So we're here at the uh, Media Tech. And uh, so who are you? Yeah, I'm Jing. Yeah. A and uh, you're launching Crossmount. Is this the first yeah. time you talk about it? No, we announced this uh, in Mobile World Congress. And so what is it for? Yeah, first we need to know what is mount. Yeah, you have USB disk. You plug into your notebook, then it becomes your hard drive. This is the concept of mount. Mount something to you, a system, then it becomes yours. So imagine this is an Android TV, yeah. this smart TV. Yeah, it may not have camera and microphone. Anyway, you can buy a USB camera and plug into the Android TV, such that the program on Android TV can use camera, just like the native camera. Nice. But with Coach Mom, you can borrow the camera from the phone and mount this camera to Android TV. Then the Android TV has camera on it, just like the native one. Which means the program on Android TV does not need to know the camera comes from. He just uses the camera like native one. Whenever it comes from USB or comes from the close mount framework. So this is a demo. It's an Android TV. You see the image? It's come from the camera from that before. Right over there. There's a... From there. So... So... So there, there, there's a camera over there connected to the TV. Yes. It's cross mount. Is it, it the protocol? How does yeah. it work? We define the protocol. So we want to open this protocol as a sender to public. Open. Oh, yeah, open. No, no license fee. No license fee. That's good. Yeah. And so, uh, is it stable? Is it good? How does it? Like, is it as good as connecting directly? Yeah, it's connected by Wi-Fi. So that's the same quality as uh, stability as a built-in camera? Or can disconnect? And then the OS yes. need to recover or what? Yeah, you need to recover. But as you know, the wireless sometimes is dirty. So with the quality may, may not compete to wire. It is always you know. <laughs> what do you show here? Yeah, let's close some demo here. So what is it? This do? is our guy for demo. Yeah. So we can change the camera. This is controller. Is this based on cross cross mount base? Yeah, it's a cross mount. You can mount the controller from TV to your mobile phone. Then your mobile phone comes the controller. So you can control the smart TV. So no need to install a special application. It would be inside Android. No, you need to modify the Android. You modify, but you want future Android to have inside? Yeah. We modify the Android to have cross mount framework. We will release this as ten key to our customer. So, so just before you were showing cross mount devices, is it you in the UI? Oh, yeah, okay. First, uh, uh, let me show you the cross mount UI. Just so right now it's just an application. It's a you. It's an application, but it's something like settings. Just you like Bluetooth and Wi-Fi. When you use cross mount, yeah, you need to. Go to this settings, then you will find the device is close mount around nearby. Is this Wi-Fi? Yeah, it's Wi-Fi. Bluetooth? No, Wi-Fi. Wi yeah. Yeah. Okay. So we just connect the Amanda. Okay. Yeah, microphone. Yeah. I mount the cam microphone from this phone to TV side. Nice. Then the Android TV has microphone. You don't need to do anything. Wow. You just use the microphone. Computer has in Taipei. Cool. Because there is some noise. Nice. So it's a problem with Google, not the okay. no microphone. Computer has in Taipei. That's very cool. <laughs> so uh, this modification of the firmware, you're modifying the yeah. Android firmware, how much? Small? Small. Small? Yeah. And uh, is it stable? Ready? You want to release now or a few months later or when? Yeah, a few months later. Make Q3. What do you need to do more? Support Bluetooth, support other things or no? Yeah, in the future. Maybe next year. So what do you need to do Q3? What is it needed now? Uh, People can contact MediaTek and you can tell them about more about No, it? Oh, because we are a trip provider. Yeah. We release this thank you to our customer like a normal PCL. So then they make the end, end product to the customer. Yeah? Yeah. So it can be inside Android TV, it can be inside uh, Gateway, 
Yes, sure. It can be inside what? Everything? Everything. We hope. It will be like a, a way to connect. Now, this is a concept demo, an interactive video. So you can, you see this is a house. Uh, this is a living room. Uh, the sun is watching the TV. Then you can mount the speaker to the TV. <laughs> Just the Wi-Fi speakers? Yes, Wi-Fi speakers. Nice. So, if you want to play game from your smart TV, but you don't have sensor, yeah. you can mount sensor from your mobile phone to TV. Nice. So basically, so you can play the game nice. on smartphone. Then the smartphone becomes just a gyro sensor to yeah. the TV side. And, uh, Maybe in the future you can connect other CPU to the TV, faster yeah, CPU. Maybe. No, that's too too much. I don't maybe. know. I don't know. Okay. Just so an idea. so it, it brings longer life to a device. Yes. They'll get upgrades in the future. Yes.